Hi everybody, welcome to my beginner point class. A lot of you have asked me to do this. I just started on point, I want some exercises to do. So I listened to you and that's what we're gonna do today. This little ballet workout is perfect if you're a beginner and just starting on point. It's perfect if you are already on point and wanna build strength. If you're coming back from an injury and you want to sort of rework into your point shoes, this is the perfect thing for you to do. So it's great for any level, um, but it is also geared toward people just starting on point. Um, I would recommend if you're an advanced dancer trying to build strength, go back and do every combination twice. Once you've built up your strength, you can do it over and over and that's how you're really going to see results. So I've put all the combination times in the box below for you to, to repeat them rather easily. If you're just starting on point, this is the perfect thing to do after a normal ballet class. You're already warm, you're ready to go, and this is like the 20 minutes of point work you would typically do at the end of your ballet class. That's what I designed this to be. It's very basic, you face the bar the entire time, so I've zoomed in from the waist down so you can really see what's happening, um, and I also talk you through every combination. So, before we get started, if you're just starting on point, I wanna show you, which I get a, a request a lot, how to actually properly tie your ribbons. I would recommend trial and error with what you wear in your point shoes. However, I don't recommend anything too thick because while it might not be the most comfortable thing to start with, you're gonna wanna eventually feel the floor, okay? So if you have really a lot of padding in your shoe, you're never gonna get to the point where that point shoe becomes part of your feet. Um, I wear lamb's wool, but I've been doing this for a while. So just do some trial and error, find out what works for you, but I would recommend not a lot of product. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put my padding in, and the way to tie your point shoe is very, very simple. We're gonna take the inside ribbon here, wrap it around here one more time until it stops on the inside, inside of your ankle. Other ribbon, same thing, wrap it around until it stops on the inside of your ankle. Look, my Ribbons are now somewhat even. Tie a little bit of a knot, not too tight, not ever fun, and just tuck it in. That's how easy it is. You don't have to wrap 14 times and everything. That's just, that's it. Let's watch one more time. So put your padding in, whatever it is. Okay, inside ribbon, once, twice. Outside ribbon, just once. Same length, tie a little knot, tuck it in, and that's it. So stick on your point shoes, find a space where you can do this, make sure your feet are somewhat warmed up, and let's give it a go. All right guys, so we're gonna start with a little warm up to kind of get your feet moving, get your feet in your shoes. It's really important that you feel like the shoe is part of your foot. So we're gonna start in parallel. And we're just gonna do little presses, one, Switch to going through the ball of the foot, three and four. Plie, rolling up, push over those shoes, straighten up, come down and reverse it up. Push over those shoes, feel that arch, rolling down three and four. Two more little presses, one and two, turning out to first and four. Then we're gonna do Plie, rolling up, press over the shoes, straighten up, rolling down, and up, reverse it. Over the shoes, rolling through demi point, and up. Plie, releve, plie, releve. Little balance, arms off the bar, rolling down, same thing in second. So, plie, rolling over those shoes, Feel that arch stretch, come down, reverse it up, press over the shoes, demi point, come down. Then two plie releve, three and four, a little balance, rolling down and finish. Okay, so four presses, roll it up, reverse it, two more presses to first. Then both in first and second, we do plie roll over those shoes, up, Reverse it over the shoes, 
and then two plie releve and balance. Seven and eight. Really through those feet. One. Pressing in two. And three. Good. Now really hit your demi point on this plie. Push those shoes over. Good. And straighten up. Try and leave the arch the way it is. Good. Up. Press over those shoes. Good. Through the demi point. Weight in the balls of the feet. Two more little presses. One and two. Back to first. And eight. Plie rolling up. One. Press over. Feel that arch stretch as you straighten up. Good. Rolling down. Reverse. Up. Plie over. Through the demi point. Heels together. Plie releve twice. Through the demi point. Three. And four. Little balance. Up. Six. Good. Rolling down. Tondu second. And eight. Plie. Rolling up. Push over those shoes. Arch. Now try and leave that arch where it is. Good. And up. Press over those shoes. Really feel that demi point. And stretch. Two more plie releve. Straight up. Three. And four. Balancing. Five. Six. Good. Rolling down. And finish in first. Good. All right, guys. So let's keep in with this theme and keeping that shape of our foot. So let's do tendu front. Push over that shoe. Feel that arch. Heel forward. Three. And four. And then two tendus. Five. Little toe back. Six. And seven. And eight. Same thing side. Tendu. Push it over. Now keep that arch. Almost feel that arch thing where it is as you straighten. Back in through the demi point. Out. And in. And out. And in. Same thing back. Tendu. As you tendu back in a point shoe, make sure we don't go back like this. Yeah? Heel stays down. Three and four, tendu back and six and seven and eight and then same thing side push and then two tendus, yeah? Right foot and then left foot and then we'll rise up after that plie. Another little push over the arches, just getting used to balancing and point shoes in first position, okay? So tendu push, tendu first, two tendus. Six. Lift it up seven, don't roll on those arches. And tendu. Push, heel forward. Three, little toes back as you tendu. Through the foot, out, and in, and out, and in. Same thing, side one. Push over the arch, now leave the arch. Three, and four. Tendu. First, tendu. And first to the back. And one. Heel down. Leave the foot. Three. And four. On your back. Good. Last time. Side. And one. Two. Three. Good. Lift it up. Don't sink. Try not to grip the bar either. Make sure you're nice and lifted. Good. Let's do the left side. On do one. Heel is four. Now keep that shape. Three. Little toes back. Lifting tall and supporting leg. Good. And side one. Push. Now leave the arch three. And four. And side. And side. Good. Same thing back. And one. Push. Leave it. Good, now little toe, same thing, heels down, two, last time, to the side, and one, push, good, three, and four, good, now we're going to rise and balance again, so, plie, over those arches, rising up, and balance, Good. Open the arms. Try not to take the bar as you lower. And finish. Good. 
Okay, guys, so we're going to do another little releve to work on your demi point. So, same thing in first and second. We're going to do four plie releve. One and two, a little quicker. Three and four, rolling through. Six, seven, and eight. Now, releve with straight leg four times. Don't plie. One and two, three and four, five, six, seven, and eight. Now, just the toes. So, high demi point. One and two, three and four, five, and six, seven, and eight. Balance again, getting into your balance. Do this a lot. Lower, six, tendu, second, and eight. Exactly the same thing. So four plie releve. One, and two, about this speed. Three, make sure you're rolling through. Four, now straight leg, this is hard. Try not to use the bar on this. Six, seven, eight, then just the toes. One, and up, two, three, Four, little balance, good, back to first, yeah? So four plie releve, four straight leg releve, four little demi point toes, and a balance. And on these demi point toes, guys, you don't want to lower. Think of keeping your heel exactly where it is and just demi point. See the difference to that? Yeah, leave the heel where it is, just demi point. That's that point strength, all this stuff that you need. Here we go. Six, seven, plie row. One, two, three, four. Good. Stay lifting up. Now rolling through, straight leg. Good. Just demi point. One, two, three, four. Good. Balance. Excellent. Second position, exactly the same thing. Plie. Plie. Good. Energy in those heels. Yeah, rolling through. Rolling through. Good. Just the toes. High heels. Two, three, four. Good. Balancing. Good. And finish. So, guys, now we're going to do an exercise that will help you learn how to shape your feet. Because point shoe is work is not just about releves and being on point. It's about knowing how to work your shoes. So we're going to do sur le coup de pied, wrap and fifth, and a wrap and fifth. Tendu out and in and out and in. That's it. So wrap and fifth, wrap and fifth, side, close front and side, close back. Yeah, wrap and fifth, little toe back. See here, I'm not going like this. Wrap fifth, wrap, and fifth, tendu, back, fifth, back, fifth, wrap, fifth, wrap, fifth, side, fifth, side, fifth, yeah? So two wraps, make sure the little toes, especially for sur le coup de pied front, little toes back, yeah? The worst thing you want to see is this. Don't do that, yeah? Wrap, and fifth, wrap, and fifth, tendu, little toe back, tendu, little toe back, yeah? We're not doing tendu here, yeah? Little toe back. Here we go. All right, so right foot front, we're gonna do right, we'll stop, and then we'll do the left. Here we go. Six, seven, eight. One, two. Tendu front, close fifth, front. Good, little toe back, little toe back. Tendu close front, tendu close back. Coupe. Good, tendu back, and back. Good, last time, one, two. Tendu out, close back, and just finish. Good. All right, other foot front. Here we go. Left side. Seven and eight. Good, heel forward, little toe back. Tendu. And three. Good. Don't sink down. Lift up on that supporting hip. Good. Give your leg space. Tendu. Close front. Tendu. Close back. Coupe. Fifth. Coupe. Good. Tendu. Back. Fifth. Back. Last time. Coupe. Coupe. And side. And whoops. I caught the floor. Good. Guys, so now we're going to work on susu. 
okay? And susu and point class might be different from ballet shoes. So we're gonna start with a plie. We're gonna do plie, tendu front, pull up to susu, lower down straight legs. That's the hard part. Plie, tendu side, up to susu, lower straight. You've gotta really lift up. Same thing to the back, plie, tendu back, susu up, you don't have to turn, I'm just turning to show you. Lower straight legs, then we're gonna do two quick susus up. Together, lower down, together, lower down. Yeah, other side. So, plie, tendu, pulling up. You have to, what you have to do here, guys, is be on the ball of the foot on your supporting leg, right? And so then all you have to do is pull right up. If you're in your heel, You've got to like shift and get up, yeah? So be on the ball of this foot, plie, tendu. I'm on the ball of this leg, I pull it up, I lower straight, plie, tendu side, pull it up, lower straight legs. You've got to really lift up for that. To the back, plie, tendu back, heel is down, susu up, lower, plie this time, and then two feet, two feet, lower, two feet, straight. Yeah? One more time. Plie, tendu, up, lower, straight. Do that front side and back, and then two feet down, two feet down. Yeah? Susu in point shoes, guys, is two feet. From plie, both feet go together. Yeah? We're not doing one, Two, okay? Two feet, two feet, okay? So plie, extend, lift, lower straight, front side and back, two susus. Here we go. Six, seven, eight, nine, 10, plie, extend, pull up, lower straight leg, lift, good. One, two, up, lifting up, plie, extend, up, Good, two susu, up and up, other side, good, one, two, up, plie, extend, susu, plie, extend, susu, two susus, let's repeat this, good, up and one, two, lift up as you lower, lift, 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 one, Good, plie, two, up, and a one. Last time, doing great, one, two, ball of the foot, two, up, good. Last time back, one, two, up, and both feet, good, and finish, nice. All right guys, so now we're gonna work on one-legged releves. We're gonna do them with plie because straight leg's a little too advanced for you guys at this point. But the key is staying in the ball of the foot. Look, my heel is down, but my weight's still over here. If you go to your heel, you can't get back up, yeah? So, staying in that ball of the foot, we're gonna start on the right leg with the left leg in coupe. So, plie, releve, four times, two and three. And four, two pas de bray, up, up, land through the ball of the foot, up, up, and land. Repeat, one, and up, two, three, four. This time, one pas de bray, up, up, fifth, plie, coupe. Now we're on the other leg. Yeah, so four of them. One, two, three, and four. Pot de break. Up, up. Watch how you land. Up, up, and land. And again, four. This time, up, up. Fifth, lower in fifth, and then pick the leg back up. Yeah? So four releve, pot de break, pot de break. Four releve, pot de break, fifth, lower in fifth, pick it up. Yeah? So we'll do right. And left, here we go. Six, seven, eight, 
So start with the right foot front, and we're going to pick up the foot on the preparation. Six, seven, and eight. Plie. Up. Two. Stay in the ball of the foot. This is hard. Three. Try not to use the bar with your arms. Good. Up. Up. Lower down. Good. Up. Up. Lower down. Again. One. Up. Stay on the ball of the foot. Three. Four. Good. Up. Up. Susu. Plie. And other side. Good. One. Up. Two. Three. Good. Up. Up. Land. Up. Up. Land. Last time. One. Two. Three. Four. Good. Up. 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 Two, two. And finish. Good. Okay, guys. So we're going to do a little a chape combination and still work on some of those susus. So starting with the right foot front, we're going to do four. Plie and out, plie and out, plie and out, plie and out. Four of them. Plie, susu, plie, susu, plie, little coupe releve, other side and up. Yeah, so four a chape. Plie and out, two, both feet together, four. Plie, two susus, plie, little coupe releve to change your leg. Yeah? So four, one and out, two, three, four. Plie, two feet, plie, two feet, plie, coupe, other side and out. Yeah? Plie on one. On a chape, make sure we don't do the the. Yeah? Both feet together. Really important. Yeah? So four of them. Two susu, one coupe releve, plie, and stretch. Okay, so starting with the right foot front, we're going to plie on one. Okay? And both feet out at the same time. Here we go. Six, seven, eight. Plie. Out. Two. Three. Both feet. Good. Plie susu. Two feet. Good. Plie coupe releve. Good. Other side. Plie. Out. Two. Good. Keep lifting up. Don't sink on this. That will help you. Lift up. Lift up. Good. And finish. Good. All right, so the last thing I want you to do, guys, we're not going to do with any music. We're going to work on our balance. So start with the right foot front. Do this along with me. Plie. We're going to go up to Susu, both feet up. Now, find your balance. Arms in first, arms in fifth, wherever you want them. Good. Balance and push those arches. Push, 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 push. Good. Find your balance. Strong feet. This might take a while to get, but just keep working on it and you'll get it. Okay, so come down. Good. Ton, do the right leg back. Let's do the other side. So get a nice deep plie. Both feet up. Good. Mine was not good. Find the balance. If you think of pushing the, where those ribbons are, push, push, push. Nice strong feet. Don't be scared of it. Point work is 90% mental. Good. Good. Stay slightly forward. Good. And finish. Great. Okay, come parallel. We're going to do one of my favorite feet stretches now. So take the right foot over and dig that foot in. Now we're going to plie. And you use this knee to push that calf. And it's a really great arch stretch. This is one of my favorites to do. Uh, you can do it all the time as much as you want to. Good. Great. Coming back up. All right, other side. Left foot, cross it over using your knee. Push that calf, plie on the right leg. Feel that arch stretch. This is how you can safely stretch your feet, guys. Don't stick them under a couch. Not a good idea. Please don't do it. Good. And come up. Great. Okay, just listen for a sec. When you're balancing, no matter where it is, you want to think of pushing 
where the ribbons are. So many people in point shoes get scared of it and they, they're, they're back off their shoe and they can't balance. Yeah, so when you're balancing, think of really pushing right here where those ribbons are. And that's gonna give you a nice strong foot. See, look, if I pull back, I'm really unstable. Yeah, but if I use all of that arch and really push those ribbons, it's gonna give me a nice solid balance, yeah? So don't be scared of it. Point work is 90% mental. Uh, so think about that. Every time you go on point, push right there. So guys, that's it. As you go along, I would recommend doing the combinations more than once. Once it starts to feel like you're, it's not a challenge to get through, repeat it, you know? Do it as many times as you want. It's very safe all facing the bar, you know, just do your best. And the biggest advice I can give you is don't grip the bar. You know what I mean? Try and use your legs, really lift up every time you do these exercises. And like we talked about, really push where those ribbons are, okay? I hope you enjoyed this. If you want more point classes, please let me know in the box below. Any other ballet workout requests, let me know. I always try and cater to you guys. If you missed my June favorites video where I talk about the Marley in this studio and the bar, uh, you can click it to watch. Love you guys so, so much, and I'll see you on Friday.